this is the butter chicken that I marinated last time I just put it out from the fridge and I will leave it outside to a room, room temperature before I pan fry it I'll put a description of uh, the marinade measurement that I put in there in the description box and here's the paste for to cook the chicken later so this is a tomato puree this is a butter chicken sauce this is a 300 gram of a butter chicken sauce this is 300 grams of a tomato puree one tablespoon of garam masala one tablespoon of paprika one tablespoon of brown sugar half tablespoon of um, salt and this is half a tablespoon of uh, tomato paste so we're gonna saute put uh, put oil later and we're gonna saute all this together and all this is gonna be mixed together with the chicken we're gonna wait for the chicken now to thaw into room temperature and now i'm making a pickles for the butter chicken i like it with this uh, pickles on the side so in the sauce i put um the juice from the canned pineapple and i put a uh, palm vinegar palm vinegar uh, four tablespoon uh, the juice from the pineapple can is three tablespoon and then uh, one and a half tablespoon of uh, sugar one tablespoon of uh, salt first I put the hard one first which is carrot then a bit of cabbage and then break it up a bit of cabbage and then always do the hard one first the hard part and the onions spread it up I'm gonna mix it later then cucumber and then tomatoes and this one on top the chili so what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna put in the fridge first I'm not gonna mix it now let it sit a bit then I'm gonna mix it and turn it around later so this is the pickles for the side of uh, the butter chicken and now the chicken is tall, I leave it outside room temperature for half an hour. And now we're gonna seal it. A high heat. Put the skin part, so put, uh, put the skin, skin down so. Uh, this, uh, this sauce, the marinade, because there's a yogurt in there, so we're gonna cook the paste first. Then we, how way we're gonna put this in it to mix it together. I'm gonna half cook this chicken, maybe around uh, ten minutes. Yeah, the fried, uh, after five minutes we were turning around. Yeah, after five minutes, I turn it around now, so it should be ready. And I'm gonna take it out. I'm gonna start to cook the paste after this. Yeah, it's char now. Now the chicken is ready. I'm gonna put it in the bowl. Put it aside and then we will start to put the sauce now. Two tablespoons of oil, not too much. Now we put in the half of the water. Put the tomato puree, the saute it first, and get the color. I'm gonna put in the butter chicken sauce. This one I get it from the supermarket. Yeah, I can try some other brand or any brand that you like. Then I'm going to 
put the rest of the sauces, the metal paste, the metal paste in. You know the garam masala, paprika, sugar, salt, all in there. For the goodies, there's still some here. We'll scoop it all in. First, make sure the herbs is cooked. What I mean, cook is that you cook it to a boiling point. Make sure the herb is cooked. Give it a taste. Okay. We're gonna mix in the uh, sauce that we marinated with the chicken earlier. And we're gonna cook it again. And then we're gonna add the chicken. Take it for, let's see, only three minutes. Check the texture again. I turn the fire into medium heat. Give it a taste again. Yeah, it's good. Need some salt. I'm gonna put one teaspoon of salt. I'll give it a mix. And here's the chicken. Here's the chicken that we cook it. And the juice, put together all the juice, just the goodies. I'm gonna put it in there. With this cooking, it's a lot of, sometimes make a mess, so you need to put a cover over it. So right now, we're gonna put it on the salt pot. So, I have a lid. There's a lid here, so we cover it. So, we check it again in five minutes. And we have a look. Yeah, it's just a clean up with this, <laughs> this uh, curry dish. Yeah. It's splattered everywhere. So, I have to clean it up. Yeah. We come back later and have a look. Now, I simmer it for five minutes already. I put in low heat and now we put in thickening cream. See one you like it creamy, put a bit more. This is around two tablespoon and I like to have a bit sour, so I put more yogurt. So put one two and we're gonna mix it everything together, then I will put the lid over. And then we're gonna let it slow simmering for another three to five minutes. Put the lid over, cover it, turn it to close to half medium heat. I'm gonna check on it now. Yes, maybe another three minutes. Oh, I assemble everything up to this. Yep, it's ready now. It's time to serve it up. I will be assembling it. There you go, friend. Butter chicken. I will be assembling everything together. The rice. This tries to go with a hot rice. And this is a basmati rice. So at home I always use basmati rice. It's always nice with rice. I don't know why, I love to put eggs in my curry. So any curry that I like, I just put eggs. And here is the pickles. It always goes good. Yeah. Uh, here's the butter chicken. Double the rice. Sauce. some 
coriander, some coriander leaves. Yep. There you go, my friend. Butter chicken. Here we are, my friend. Today I cook butter chicken.